Here is an example of one way to track resources. For our purposes, some of the specifics for this incident have already been entered. In the working incident field, any incident showing smoke, fire, medical, or hazmat will be yes. Select no when nothing is showing. This indicates you are in command option investigation. Dispatch may be requested to make notification. Your agency may have a standard of declaring a working incident in which dispatch would automatically make all necessary notifications. Provide a brief description of the building. Consider requesting additional alarms early in the incident. Additional alarms are often needed for multi-occupancy and commercial structure fires, as first alarm resources will be used up rapidly. Declare your current strategy. The all-clear benchmark is only declared when the entire building has been cleared of all occupants. The fire control benchmark is only declared when the fire is no longer growing or has been contained. The lost stop benchmark is hit when the fire is out and salvage and overhaul has been completed. Emergency traffic is used when declaring a mayday for identification of unseen hazards, or for a change in strategy from offensive to defensive. PAR checks should be performed at the completion of benchmarks, a change in strategy, or upon notification of emergency traffic. In the lower left corner, identify units as they are dispatched. Do not check the arrive box until units are staged or on scene. Fill in the assignments as orders are given and confirmed. Individual tasks may be checked as assigned or when completed. The empty field can be used to track resources and or to diagram the incident. One way to track resources is to use T-boxes. In the top left, indicate the location where assignments are to be completed. In the lower left, list the units assigned to perform these tasks. In the lower right, know what work is to be done. When a group or division is formed to complete the work, note the designator change in the top right. For example, Engine 1 is assigned to take their own water supply and spot their engine on the A side of the structure. Then to extend the line to the A side front door and set up for fire attack. In the event Engine 1 requests additional resources and the IC decides to form an interior division, you can expand the T-box as follows. Engine 1 is notified they are now Interior Division, and that Engine 2 has been assigned to them. Circle Engine 1 to identify them as Division Supervisor. Interior Division is now responsible for all personnel on Engines 1 and 2. As tasks are completed, cross them out in the function area. Once all assignments are completed, Identify them as reassigned, in rehab, or released. Another way to track resources is to note the division or group supervisor along the bottom as follows. Indicate group or division in the top box. In the first box, identify the division. Next, note the supervisor. The remaining lines are for all other units assigned interior division. Our position is not to tell you this is the way to track units. It is only one way. Find and use a method that works for your department.